Good morning, lights. I have a message for you today. I have been saving it for quite some time. The reason is, I wasn't sure if you were ready. I wasn't sure if the moment was opportune. However, I have decided that the time is now. I cannot possibly wait any longer. Even though many individuals put forth a lot of effort and do all that they can, they are unable to advance. They are mostly unconscious, not physically, but more metaphysically, and not externally, but within. Even though they can move, think, imagine and dream. Their life is based in unconsciousness. They go through life day by day, unconscious, not aware. The occasions when they feel fully aware are quite rare and they live like robots, mechanically efficient but unconscious. Hence the whole problem. And there is a clear explanation for why the majority of people are asleep. People's desire to be awake is the only thing that will keep them awake. It is true that there are a variety of reasons why humans prefer to sleep, including our fascination with mental tricks. But that is not the whole picture. The majority of individuals don't recognize how sleepy they are, which is the underlying cause. Most of us live like robots or corpses, or we pretend to be awake, while in reality we are dreaming slowly. We do everything it takes to prevent ourselves from being conscious of our true selves. The majority of individuals lead mostly unconscious and automatic lives. They go through the motions of life, but do so in a trans-like condition, with no knowledge whatsoever of what they really think and what they truly feel within themselves. Their instinctive thinking about the problem does not provide them enough room for self-reflection and self-improvement. Even if they may know deep down that something is wrong with their lives and have no clue how to address it. To put it another way, you must first comprehend what your life means and why it is occurring in order to awaken from your slumber. You will then have the option of choosing whether you wish to be awake or sleeping. We cannot hear the voice of our souls beckoning us back to everlasting love and serenity because we are all sleeping at heart. We are sleeping because we are terrified of everything. 
of life and death, of loneliness, of being cut off from God, of losing control of our lives, of changing, as we become more conscious of who we truly are and of letting go. An engaged volition is necessary for human enlightenment. The will has to be ready to step forward and seize control of the body and intellect. The principles of conditioning inside conscious mind as well as those of physical environment it exists prevents it from being free. You must first become aware of something in your life via mindfulness or meditation in order to alter it. To figure out what patterns of thinking you are mostly producing, you must study yourself from inside. Enlightenment may be attained via meditation. It may assist you in determining what prevents you from reaching your maximum potential. I have a strong belief in the ability of the consciousness. You don't have to be a saint to ascend. I am not suggesting that at all. I am simply stating that in order to recognize the potential of rising, you must be awake and aware enough. The ascension energy will flow through your body when you are completely awake. It will seem as if your spirit is doing it naturally. Every level of being, including the physical, emotional, mental, spiritual and cosmic, is awakened during ascension. We experience an elevated condition of being where we can deal with our lives on higher levels rather than merely responding based on our present reality. This is, of course, our ego, thanks to the instantaneous change from third density to the fifth density, or dimension if you will. The barriers to ascension will be lifted by allowing your energies to be released, by opening your heart and trying to increase your consciousness. You are enabling yourself to vibrate at a higher frequency. When you identify any barriers and remove them, we are in an age of ascent. We are here to assist the world vibrate at a higher frequency, to expand our consciousness, to love and support one another, and to become closer to the idea of global community. Your life is going to grow significantly, just as the cosmos does. You need to understand that you are not just the sum of your past errors. What you are capable of doing, not what you have done defines you. Our genuine liberty emerges from an inside comprehension of who we are, not through external activity. By doing this, we may concentrate on each new day from a different angle. Whether we are aware of it or not, we are all expanding our awareness. And that is what matters in the situation. The ascension of the human race has already started and it is becoming nearer by the day. There is no doubt that ascension will occur if we cooperate for the common benefit. My friends, the barriers to ascension will be lifted and they can only be lifted if you allow your energy to be released. You have to open your heart and try to increase your consciousness. You have to be in the present moment and believe that the time has come. You are enabling yourself to vibrate at a higher frequency when you identify any barriers and choose consciously 
to remove them. As always, we love you deeply and wish for you to have the most abundant and joyous life possible. Have a wonderful day. Lies within